When I have the henna crown on, it's as if people don't see the sickness as much as they do when your head is just bald. They just look and they see this beautiful artwork and it's empowering. It's nice to feel almost normal again. My name is Sarah Walters and I'm a professional henna artist. The term henna crown is being used to describe intricate henna designs that are applied to the scalp following hair loss, um, typically. So usually people will refer to henna crowns as being applied to people who've gone through chemotherapy. I initially began doing henna crowns when my mom asked me to do one for her friend who had recently lost her hair during chemotherapy. So I agreed to do it and it was a wonderful experience. From that point on, I knew that I wanted to continue to offer crowns for people. My name's Vicki Sumner, and I have stage four breast cancer. Once cancer becomes stage four and it travels to other organs, it then becomes a terminal diagnosis. And so everything we do from here is just trying to stay alive. I'll probably start you know, at the front, maybe on this side or this side? I originally looked for a henna crown because I wanted to share a message on my head. The message on the back says stage four needs more. Stage four breast cancer needs more attention. For years, it's been sort of swept under the rug. Nobody wanted to talk about it because it's terminal cancer. When I go in to get my henna crown, it is like a spa-like experience. Sarah scents it with lavender and it's calming and soothing and sometimes I nod off a little bit. It takes about an hour, hour and a half and it's just relaxing and you wake up and see the beautiful artwork that she's come up with when you're finished. My daughter loves it when I come home and I have the henna. She's like, oh, you got it again. Yay. <laughs> I think that everyone is beautiful in their own way. And I can see the beauty in these people that come to me wanting a crown because they're displaying a lot of strength and resilience and fight. At the same time, they're feeling maybe a lack of confidence or you know discomfort about the loss of their hair and other things that they're going through. And when the crown that I do for them gives them that boost of confidence, it's, it's just a really awesome feeling because it does make them feel a little more beautiful, I think, in some cases. So pretty. Yay! I'm so glad work. you like it. I always believe that we should try to make other people smile during the day and that we should always do something kind for the people around us. Sarah's one of those people. Sarah's one of those people trying to make a small difference to the people around her by offering the henna crowns to people suffering from cancer. It just makes the world a better place.